Alright, what's up guys? I'm Compton EMT. I am your host here for Mini Tournament 8. This is our 8th Mini Tournament. We've also had two grand tournaments, but uh, yeah. Um, I am a little under the weather today. I woke up with 101 degree fever. If you were watching my stream the last two days, I was basically hacking up a lung. Got plenty of uh, tea this morning, though I realized uh, there's a lot of caffeine in this black tea that I'm drinking. I've had about 10 of them so far, so I'm like, woo! So yeah, we're gonna get started here. Um, yeah, so we had 11 teams sign up. This is a 2v2 tournament. We had 11 teams sign up. Uh, let's jump on over to our 16 man, or 16 team bracket here. So out of the teams that showed up, we have Jotunheimer, we have Momo, Hot Dog, Death Dealers, Break, Washed up, downvote, one win, swag, and average Joes. So since there are 10 teams, we're going to have two early round games. Usually we don't stream these, but there is a very special case that uh, that I just want to stream, and it's going to be that Momo versus Hot Dog game. This is a couples game. So both teams are a boyfriend-girlfriend, a couple, and they're going to fight each other. So we are going to... Uh, jump in on that and view that game so and <coughs> see there I go already coughing so yeah guys <laughs> yes <laughs> team swag is what I'm calling you I'm calling you swag because it's just it's just easier it's easier all right so yeah <clears throat> let's get to it so I do have a game up. It looks like that uh, that couple's game is all ready to go. So let me uh, jump on over and we'll view that game. Alright, so here we go. Polka Dots in On Tilt versus Scroyan and Bellis. So we are getting into this game. This is game one, ladies and gentlemen, <coughs> of this Brawlhalla Mini Tournament 8. <clears throat> Sorry if I'm coughing in your ear. I'll try to mute uh, as much as possible. So in the red we do have Momo. In the blue we have Hot Dog. Looks like we do have a King Roland and 
a Scarlet coming out. So two Lance users, one very heavy on the attack, on the force, the other very heavy on the defense. On the other side, we have a Roland with the chin skin coming from Polka Dots there, and then on tilt in his Lucian right now. So we do see... A Nice little cluster there in the middle of people just kind of damaging each other. Nice bomb throw by On Tilt there to hit Bellis. And On Tilt right now, not really using weapons, more or less just going for the uh, the explosives at this point. Bellis almost landing on that mine, barely missing it. And we are even, but First Blood comes back as Scroyan taking out On Tilt. Oh, 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 Bellis off the map. Can Bellis get back? No. <coughs> so we are evened up at 3-2, 3-2 right now. Oh, Scroyan almost went off. Oh, beautiful, beautiful recovery there from Montel. He does miss the follow-up recovery, but Scroyan right now in very, very red. Same with, uh, with Polka Dots, but... Polkadot's doing a good job with that Roland. And, you know, the funny part is we did see Bellis go down there. Two, the two people who still had three stocks were the Rolands. The reason for that is that huge armor value. So that armor is going to make it a lot harder for you to get launched and hit the boundaries of the map. So. <laughs> oh, it's Royan almost getting that heavy. And right now it's it's a whole two stock lead though we do see Bellis take down polka dots right there to kind of almost even up that score it is a four to three stock game right now a <laughs> nice push by on tilt with that side air to knock Bellis into the mine get a little bit of extra damage there and a nice launch Yeah, it is down now to just scrolling here in this first game. Bellis is out. Polka Dots and On Tilt up. Four stocks, two Scroyans, two. Scroyan doing a nice little transfer there on the bottom of the map. Not something you see a lot on these very wide uh, islands. So right now, Scroyan being chased around by Polka Dots and On Tilt. Right here, you know, he might be just kind of looking for that... Uh, that moral victory where he, you know, actually gets them down to maybe two stocks total before getting knocked out. You know, we will see. It's possible that he could do that, but I don't see him really coming back here and winning this game with it being a four stock to two stock affair, especially with him being in the red at this point. Beautiful, beautiful signature out of Polka Dots there. She knew that Scroyan did not have any more jumps at that point. You know, couldn't really move around, so went ahead and did that signature, got the KO there on Scroyan. On the enemy team, or what? Yeah, there can't be two snipers, there's only one sniper, you know, there's only one of each character at a time. Oop, accidentally unmuted, uh, unmuted my mumble. <laughs> yeah, early game, early game. Right here, Scroyan doing his best to just kind of stay alive. Still, it's a two, it's a four stock, two one stock affair at this point. And that was a beautiful ground pound there by Ontel, but Scroyan bringing it back and actually making the recovery. And Scroyan does finally get that KO there on On Tilt, bringing it to a 3-1 to one game. He is in the red at this point, so it's going to be even harder now for him to make this comeback, if he even does. And there it is, with the recovery on tilt, finishes out that game one. Three stocks of their six remaining. And game one goes to Hot Dog.
All right, so game two should be incoming. Looks like GGs are being thrown out by both teams. <coughs> hey, what's up, Ari? Good to see you. <laughs> so, yeah, looking at it, it does look like we're going to get the same lineups here of that Scarlet Roland and then that Lucian Roland. <coughs> Scarlet says she don't know how to recovery. So, yeah, here we go. Game two of Hot Dog. <coughs> Sorry. Hot Dog versus Momo. Early wild card game going on here. So, right now, Hot Dog in the blue is up one game. We will see how this uh, how it turns out if Momo can actually pick up a win here and send it to three games. <laughs> so yeah, early damage coming out here. A lot of lances on on the field right now. Every character capable of using a lance has one. On tilt with a nice kill there on Scroy and Scroy had used his dodge to get back to the wall. On tilt saw that, went for the ground pound, got it. Oh, beautiful kill there. It is now a six to four. I don't know if uh, if Momo is going to be able to come back from this. Is Scroyan already in orange at this point? And yeah, both these teams are a set of couples. So on tilt, polka dots a couple, then Bellis and Scroyan a couple. So this is our couples match. We can call it like the newlywed game, even though they're not newlyweds. Yeah. Dominating. <laughs> So yeah, it is a six to two right now. Right now, Hot Dog really taking it to Momo. Um, Bellis might be falling down. No, gets the corner of the wall, but then falls off again, and it's down. Could we see a six stock here? I don't think in a two v two we've ever. Nope. There it is. Tilt does an accident. We almost saw our first ever six stock in competitive 2v2 play there. But uh, on tilt had to go and mess it up at that point. Scroyan really hurting in the red. Nice recovery by on tilt, but once again, that, uh, that armor from Roland helping out Scroyan there. Hahaha. <laughs> Polkadot's just doing down heavies with Roland there. Nice recovery to finish it off. And yeah, that's it, guys. That's our first match down. Hot Dog moves on. So yeah, let's go ahead and update that. Hot Dog does move on. Let's go ahead and look at our brackets. All right, so Hot Dog moves on. They are going to be facing Jotunheimer a little bit later in the quarterfinals. Uh, let's see if we have results on our other wildcard game here. Doo -doo -doo. So our other wildcard game was actually one win versus team down vote. I don't know if they are still playing or not, but... Uh, let me see if I can jump in on that game and see uh, see what's going on there. Let's see, so team downvote. Wait, why why would downvote be what? Oh yeah, duh. All right, so yeah, let me go ahead and see if I can jump in on that game in a public lobby. Spectate. All right. <clears throat> So it looks like we are waiting for that game to start. 
me jump on over. Alright, so our second wildcard game. I don't know uh, how many games they've finished so far. Sorry guys, I do not mean to be coughing in your face. Coming in uh, sick today, but hey, whatever. <laughs> All right, so it's going to be uh, it's going to be downvote versus one win. So downvote is going to be Mars and Truck Thunders. One win is going to be Mongello and Dope. So here we go. Let's see. Uh, let's see how it goes here. All right, so coming out from one win, Mangello in the Vrax, and Dope as Orion. So we're going to get two Lance characters, one with a spear, one with guns here. It's going to be very, very uh, tough to kind of beat out that zoning of the Lance, especially with two of them. Um, we did see the zoning not really come and be as effective in that first match uh, with Team Momo even though they did put up a good fight. It does look like Mars going with the Roland, so now we have three Lance characters. We're just waiting on Truck Thunders, who is going with Vrax, so all four all four players can have a Lance in this, uh, in this matchup. All right, thanks, Barrel Boy. Thanks. All right, so here we go. Wild card number two. One win versus downvote. <sighs> right now, the the only people really using weapons mainly was Truck Thunders. Truck Thunders getting those pistols really early, but uh. But yeah, they do have they have taken the most damage there. <coughs> Team downvote. Whoa! Beautiful from dope right there. That down heavy actually uh, gets a nice throw, not a KO, but it's one of those moves that I really love. And we get our first blood as Mongello taking out Mars. Yeah, right now, Team Downvote really needs to find some way to even this up. I mean, both of the characters on one win are in red at this point. A good heavy will get them, but we do see Truck Thunders go down to Dope, and then Mars actually pay back Mongello with a KO right there as well. <coughs> oh, and Mars in trouble. Does get back with that recovery of the Lance. One of the recoveries that moves quite a bit of distance. That and the guns are probably the two recoveries that move the furthest. Oh, and Truck might have decided to wait for that as he does end up getting hit by that bomb as well. And right now, Truck doing a lot of damage with that with that Lance does get taken out by Dope though on the on the side heavy there on the ground. Beautiful mind throw by Truck. Oh, nice, nice neutral signature there by Mongello to hit Mars and get some good damage off. Dope doing a juggle there with the neutral airs, that flame roll as we like to call it. Nice double from Mongello with that side signature to finish it out. 
And yeah, that's a four stock game, guys. Game one it goes to one win. <coughs> So yeah, coming up on game two. <laughs> Mongello is a bloody cheater, according to according to Barrel Boy. And Lance, I don't believe is OP. You just have to you have to come at it a different way than you play every other weapon. That's why people think it's OP. But, I mean, there are very easy ways to beat it. To me, personally, as a Lance player now for some time, probably the weapon I have the biggest problem with is the Hammer. Just because it outranges the Lance, and, you know, it's got the scoop and the poop. So the recovery and the D-Air absolutely demolish a Lance. So here we go, game two. Alright, so game two here. Mongello and Dope versus Truck Thunders and Mars. So Truck Thunders and Mars is team down vote. Dope and Mongello are team one win. Team one win up by one win right now, actually. Looks like we get the same lineups as well as we do have the Vrax Orion versus the Vrax. <coughs> Vrax Roland. Nice. Two KOs right there and two more KOs. So we're down to a four stock game here. Everybody at 0% damage. So it's still anybody's game. We might be able to see uh, Team Downvote actually make a comeback and send this to a game three maybe. Though Mongello with those side heavies and now that neutral signature as well. Beautiful down air from Mars. So yeah, Team Downvote here putting a lot of damage and the double knockout coming out from Mars. So now they are a clear two stocks ahead at this point. Beautiful bomb throw off the bounce there from Mars, but Mars really in trouble right now as he is in red. Picks up the Valkyrie horn, Valkyrie horn. And there it is, Mars goes down, so it's a 3-2 game at this point. Truck Thunder's in a bit of trouble as it was a 2v1 situation there for a little bit and they were both edge guarding him. Nice punishment right there from Truck Thunders. And it does make it back on. Dope goes down, so it's now a 2v1 here for down vote. Mongello almost getting that KO there. High KO on Mars, but Oh, ho, ho. nice ground pound from Mongello. So now it's still a 2v1, but he's down to one stock apiece. And Mongello in trouble as he is in the red at this point. Beautiful side heavy unarmed from Mongello. It looks like Mars goes down off of a bad recovery, but Truck Thunders grabbing that last KO there on Mongello. We're going to a game three, ladies and gentlemen. Game three incoming. Our first game three of MT8. And yeah, I'm already, that cup of tea is gone. So I do have a soda here, though. <clears throat> All right. Let's see what's going on. So they're doing a map pick here. We have instantiated map picking kind of rules now into these uh, into these tournaments. So you know, first game is you guys pick, and the game sorts it out. Next game is losers pick, and the if there's a third game, it is also losers pick. So yeah, they're just getting that map sorted out.
Alright, looks like they are going to go back to Mammoth at this point. Alright. Here we go, game three, the last game of this match. This is a do or die situation, ladies and gentlemen. Six stocks to go on each team. Who moves on? We'll find out. So early damage coming out here. Truck Thunders with the nice neutral signature. That double lance is very hard to kind of counteract as there's just so much zoning capability. Dope with a nice juggle neutral air hit after that dodge. One of those things that you see a lot of lance players do. They'll actually move their body to make that last hitbox hit after a dodge. Truck almost getting that nice combo there missing that second hit there beautiful bomb from I think that was Mongello hits truck thunders and it's it's an evened up game right now <coughs> oh ho ho Beautiful teamwork there as Truck knocks Dope right into the path of that mine and they're one stock up at this point. And it looks like Mars still hanging around with that red damage. Nice down air from Mars, but he does get hit. And it looks like he's going... No! Grabs the corner, makes that comeback, but now gone as Mongello does that side signature to him. Oh, and there we go, evened up there, as Truck does go down. Ooh. The show must go on, no matter how sick I am. <laughs> Alright, so right now, Mars in the orange, Mongello in the red, as we do see it go to a 2v1 now, as Truck goes down and it's Mars all by himself with his Roland and there no Mars does not get taken out there <coughs> still alive but that could be it that is one stock left for Mars compared to the three four team one win <coughs> Alright, so Mars does get a KO there, but in the red at this point, Mongello in the red as well. Really, he needs to focus on Mongello, try to get that KO, but that's going to be it right there as that side heavy unarmed comes out of Mongello. So team one win will be moving on, and we're going to be in quarters, guys. Alright, so two matches down, let's jump on over to our bracket.